You're watching Life on Video. What's up, everybody? So, we're out here today. Um, it's been a while since we filmed anything. <laughs> I'm getting like stir crazy in the house, but it's cool, you know, working from home and everything. I'm definitely enjoying the change of pace. Um, but what we're doing today is I got my drone and like this first person view gear and I haven't got to fly it yet because obviously this whole lockdown and I used to fly my drone all the time in my house but since they finally established a new development behind my house I can't film there anymore um, because obviously I'm not trying to fly over people's houses and freak them out as you can tell it's a little windy here it's always windy out here it never fails so Wish me luck, but I just referred my drone, so hopefully it'll work. Let's test it. One of the things that you guys may or may not know is that Disneyland is reopening. Now, it's not the Disneyland in Anaheim. It's Disneyland Shanghai. And that's actually scheduled to open this Monday, which, what's today? The 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, so it's 11th of May 2020, um, Disneyland Shanghai is going to actually open. Now, there are lots of new restrictions and safety measures and precautions that they're going to be taking upon reopening the park, but you better believe everything is riding on this. So they're on a different timetable than us with their pandemic. You know, it started a lot sooner in China than it did here. So believe that how they handle this reopen uh, this reopening is going to deem probably a lot of how we attack our reopening of things here in America for example you know like is taking people's temperature actually worth it at the gates whether it's at a sporting event or an amusement park or some kind of large gathering uh, is wearing a mask necessary are all these social distancing precautions still necessary so like all feelings for Disney aside, whether you love it or you hate it, just know that there's a lot riding on Disneyland Shanghai right now for everybody. So that could easily, they could easily find something to implement that could strike, strike with people here in America. And now guess what? NFL's back uh, or MLB comes back to finish out the season or something else, you know? So regardless of how you feel about Disney, this is a monumental moment in the world. And Disney's taking the first step to give it a try, see what happens, see what they get from it. And uh, I can't say enough thanks for trying. And I mean, at some point, somebody has to. That's just how it is. Somebody has to eventually try. And I mean, if somebody's gonna try and do it right, it's gonna be Disney, so stand by. We'll wait to hear more, but for the next couple weeks, eyes are gonna be on Shanghai for sure. All right, the drone is just as fun as I remember, but with that first person view on it, man, get some distance with it. Like, I was way out over the desert, uh, and it's not even close to losing signal. I believe it's like got a 1.2 mile uh, radius that you can be from the actual receiver and still get Ooh. this wind is a great test for my new ceremonic microphone that I have connected to this so I've got gotten tons of equipment since uh, this whole pandemic lockdown went on you know I got my drone back up um, which is right here just had a blast flying it um, I got a new ceremonic mic for vlogging and I'm still dying to test all this out, so this is gonna be like my first real test and my first field test for this equipment. So that's all for now. I just wanted to give a quick update, show you my new gear, let you know that I'm still alive, still here, still trying to get some content so out. Stay so. tuned for more content here on Life on Video. Later.